Hello, Matt Entertainment here. Welcome to another video tutorial for SP Page Builder 3. In this lesson, I want to show you a really cool feature or one of the cool features that was added to Page Builder, and that's the ability for you to add little style and design to your, your modules here. So to access Page Builder on the front end, you first have to log in. So let's log in here. Once you've logged in, you want to click on Edit Page. So right now we have the alert module on here and I want to show you some something really cool that they added. So you want to go over to this little row options and go over to style. Now scroll down. You're going to notice that you have top shape and you have bottom shape. So click on enable shape. As you click on it, you notice you have this beautiful shape right here, the cloud flat. This is another really, really cool feature that they added that gives you so much more options when it comes to styling and designing your page. So let's say you don't like that cloud fly, you click on the drop down, you click on cloud opacity, you can change the opacity of the cloud and you click on, you can choose something paper torn. So as you choose each one here, it shows you what that looks like. So if you want to be really creative, you can utilize one of these as you're designing your site and you can choose the color. So you don't want that color, you click here on the color and you can choose and it's just changing and showing you what that color looks like. You can ch choose the width. Do you want it more extended? Do you want it a little half? You can choose the height. You can choose to flip, which is going to flip it over. You can choose to invert. You can choose to bring to the front. So the bring to the front, it brings that particular item to the front and it put the content that's there on the back of it. And you can do the same too on the bottom. You notice when you click enable shape on the bottom that enables that part of so, if you want a different shape up top and a different shape at the bottom, you can do that as well. So you click on the shape again. So you can have different shapes and you can have different color. And as you're changing it, you can see it in real time. So it gives you a really good idea to see is this how you want it to be. Even before clicking on save, you can change the height, you can choose to flip, you can choose to bring to the front, just like that. So if you're a creative person, you want to see how different things look, you can kind of mess around with this uh, and see what you come up with. But that is one of the really, really cool features that Page Builder 3 has. And I love it because now I can be able to do this without having to go create another CSS type of file and, and change things like that. So give it a try and let me know how you like it. And thanks so much again for watching. If you like this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button so that anytime that I release a brand new video, you're going to be the first person to get access to it.